Hello everybody and welcome back to Rule the Waves 2 as Japan. <clears throat> we are currently at war with France. Uh, we have reinforced Southeast Asia, given the fact that we now own the Caroline Islands, uh, as well as Formosa. Uh, so we just fought off like a raid at Truk. Uh, the French have invested heavily in Southeast Asia. They're currently got seven battleships here, two light cruisers, nine destroyers. Uh, us and Great Britain outnumber them quite heavily. I'm hoping that we can bleed them for VP and hopefully uh, go through this and get some of the French Southeast Asian territories. That would be really great. Uh, we'll see, though. I don't know if that's going to work out. Currently, France is blockaded. Like, it's not, it doesn't say they're blockaded, but I mean, with how many things are there, I'm hoping they are. Uh, they're definitely not doing well in the med. Yeah, they're definitely not doing well in the med. So, we can hope. Uh, but right now, we're going to have to go ahead and go to the next turn, see what happens. We can't invade anything because we don't have the range for that, unfortunately. Okay, convoy defense to medium engagement. We will accept. What do we got? Just some destroyers. Okay. Oh yeah, that's a big uh, that's a big convoy. Hoping these are not like uh, big ships. I'm hoping these are just fellow destroyers. We'll see. They look like fellow destroyers. That looks like a light cruiser. Nope, just fellow destroyers. Of which they are overclassed. Because we have a lot more. Come on. It's just two destroyers. Which we can fight them off easily enough. It's, n it's morning, so... We've got plenty of time to fight. It is low clouds, so our vision is limited. They're going for our convoy. We're going to go ahead and do something here. I want you to not be AI controlled. Let's see what he got. 29 knots. He's a quick little bastard. What is he? He's a 700 ton displacement. And you are a 700 ton displacement. We've got 600 tons. Come on. We outnumber you. Okay. There we go. We split them in half. Which is good. He's going to go in 20 knots. So we got him to break off. Oh, yeah. We got him. Practically to rights here. Whole gun line on that one destroyer. 
we can just make sure they're targeting the correct one. There we go. All guns on that destroyer. That is your total objective. Destroy that destroyer. Twenty-five knots. Keep that going. Come on, hit him. What is he firing? What's his guns? He's got four inchers, two four inchers. What do we got? We're using three inchers on these guys. Come on. Okay, we hit him. If we can just destroy him, we can actually cut their combat capabilities in half. This guy took a bad hit. Two light hits caused some flotation damage and knocked his max speed down a lot. Okay, we're going to go ahead and try and cut in behind him. Get a gun line as he goes back to his friend. Starting to run low on ammo. Wish that we had some British heavier ships coming in, but the convoy's down that way, so that's good. Still pretty north of Formosa here. Come on. There we go, we get an extra knot of speed now that the uh, young has broken off from the formation. Okay, we're running low on ammo on the guns that are to bear. She's sinking because she took a bad hit. Break you off. Maybe you can go rescue survivors. Okay, we're breaking off from contact, heading back to the Yungi. Uh... Hopefully some survivors can be picked up here. Okay, we got some bad... Got some bad storms. Let's head back to our convoy. Alright, still a victor, because they did not sink any of our transports, which is good. So yeah, did lose a destroyer, but it was one of the older ones. 
so a major victory there. Got the gyroscope, increased torpedo range and speed. Nothing new for the subs. The operations of our ally Great Britain add 220 VP, that's good. All right. Still building up more of these Corvettes. 600 ton destroyer. We got 900 ton displacements on destroyers now, so can we build them? 900 ton, quality, uh, so caliber four, quality one guns. 33 knots, cramped accommodation. I don't like cramped accommodation. If we go normal, that's good. Range, medium, six ton difference there. Okay, what can we sacrifice? What can we sacrifice? Need six tons, six tons, six tons. Normal, no. Speed is what we need. 55, so 32 knots, 55 tons spare. Can pick up a couple extra rounds because we don't want to run out. 250 rounds for both guns. So at 10,000 is 0, 0, but at 9,000 it's 1.152. Okay, if we go to five inch guns. Yeah, it's still better. It's still better. Well, three inch belt at 5,000. Yeah, it's better for us to go to five inchers. Rate of fire modifications down a little bit, but it's still good for us. That still gives us better chances of knocking out enemy ships. Uh, so yeah, I'm good with that. We'll go ahead, and this is the A, hey, and we're gonna call it the Yang, the Yang guy. Uh, I think the yeah, the Yang or the Yan guy, Yangi, Yangi. We're gonna call it the Yangi after the ship that we lost. So yeah, there we go. That'll be up there pretty soon. Okay. Mm, oh right. Uh. Let's see, what do we have here? How many light cruisers? Three. How many light cruisers we got here? Six. Uh, let's look. Northeast Asia, light cruisers. Southeast. Okay, these two are going to be set as raiders. Yes. And a Shishima class will also be set as a raider. And we're going to see what they do to the enemy. Alright, next turn. Cruiser action against the French. Small battle. Except, French decline. Okay, a new light cruiser commissioned into the Navy. The enemy sent out feelers, uh, neutral nations about a negotiated peace without border changes or, or reparations. Should not let them get off likely. Continue until we secure total victory. Found our mutually unacceptable vans. There we go. Hey, 12 inch guns at quality zero. That's actually good. All right. Nothing in the rating so far. Okay. The Yonggi uh, class destroyer. pump eight out okay that'll good because the fuso will be done in two months we got plenty of spare cash on hand that works subs are doing their job yeah hoping yeah french aren't looking that great right now let's hope we can continue doing well against the french all right, now, oh, next turn. Enemy coastal raid. Estimated enemy forces, six battleships, seven destroyers. Don't know where the hell their cruisers went off to. Except that. It's a medium engagement. 
Alright. Let's go ahead and see what they're going to do around Formosa. Okay, transport, transport. Their objective is going to be to sink transports. It's two light cruisers going straight in for a transport. Nope, those are destroyers. No sign of enemy cruisers yet. We're going to go to normal so we don't lose anything in the action. I'm not seeing any, any, any enemy ships other than them. Though they could be a screening force, they might not have light cruisers to spare for that, so they're kind of press-ganging in some destroyers. Hit the Dardanelle. Back. Okay. Getting good hits in. They're destroyers, so they're not going to be too durable. Okay. I also don't have a lot of destroyers in this uh, area of operations. I think they had 9 or 12 last time I looked. We can hit them. Hopefully do some decent damage. So far, whenever our destroyers have been sneezed at, they've gotten three-quarter flotation damage. So I'm hoping that we can... Do the same to them. Our light cruisers are pretty good. Yeah, I think... Yeah, you've got 10 4-inch guns, 2.5-inch belt. You've got the same, so it, yeah, you should be okay. you got 3 inches of armor. Or no, no. 2.5-inch belt, so I mean, you've got decent armor. Twenty knots. Come on. Could break these guys off. Should have plenty of sp no twenty one knots. Yeah, they're not going to be able to do anything. Get a collision course or like a intersecting course going on right now. We'll gain some speed on them. Not a lot. There was one knot dif difference between us, but it'll still be something. The Dardadel class has been hit the most. Okay, we're trying to change facing here to try and gain some distance, but it didn't work. Gave our guns more of a uh, shot on them for a bit. Come on. Twenty knots. Twenty knots. Come on. A couple of sank ships. That's all we want. Oh, for a second I thought a, like a, a torpedo was trailing us, that little bump right there, but I th think that was just a glitch. Whew. Scared me. They've got to be going faster than 20 knots. We're losing distance on them. Oh, uh, yeah. One of our ships has gotten tired. So 
So what are you going to do, my friends? You're going to go out and then come back in? Is that your objective? Little cruise. Double back. So they probably either went this way or this way. Alright, now we'll patrol around the waters here. Seeing what we see. Just gonna do some cruising. Oh, there's a good shot they just broke off action. Yep. Thought so. Medium damage to one, light damage to another. They had a transport, but they failed their mission. Yeah, they went out to sea. Formosa was too strong for them. Our scientists are happy to report that they are close to mastering superimposed X turret. All right. Uh, friendly merchant sank one. Friendly submarines lost two. That sucks. Uh, okay, we did sink one enemy merchant, so it's a five for five. That's not bad. Japanese raider. Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. Things are being built up. New destroyers are being built. One more month for this Fuso to be built. A couple more months for these Corvettes to be done. We'll send them down to Southeast Asia to take their stations, permanent stations. Because uh, there's really no other use for them uh, than just a garrison, uh, ports and etc. So, yeah. What do the French have here? 7-7. Seven, seven. Not a lot. They don't have anything in our home waters, except for a heavy cruiser and a light cruiser. A bit there. Nothing there. And a bit there. A bit there. Yeah, they're pretty spread out. Okay, next turn. Actually, we'll do unrestricted. Nah, no unrestricted. We'll go prize rules. Alright, next turn. Fleet battle at Formosa. So this is their full battleship fleet against our fleet. Question is, will they undertake it? It's a good possibility they will. We'll accept. Some ships from our... Yeah, there we go. Some Great Britain, British allies. So what do we got in terms of our order of battle? So a light cruiser division. So they, they sent a light cruiser division, which consists of... Okay, the Pandora and the Calypso, which are in front here. So the Pandora is a Comus class, 2-inch belt, 3,000 tons, 21 knots, two 6-inch guns and turrets. And I think the Calypso is probably the same. Yeah, Calypso is the same. It's a Comus class. All right, so this is a full, a full fleet engagement. We do have some more light cruisers. We have more cruisers than they do, so we can possibly use that to corral their forces. That, and also this is an advantageous position because they're going to be sailing here. This is going to be in their backs, and it's open this direction. So let's see what they got. That is a heavy cruiser. So they got their heavy cruisers out here. They're going to have a limited number of destroyers. Basically, they're going to have a limited number of everything. It's not going to be great for them. So what we're going to have to do is get our battleships into a singular line. So that we can utilize them all together. There's a possibility they have more battleships than us. We're going to want to go through this direction, and then I want you, instead of being a formation of a screen, to go line ahead. 
get you to reconnect with your friendlies. Okay, what do we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So there are seven enemy battleships, but they've got no support. Their support's basically... Basically non-existent. I want you to go... Okay, you're in line ahead. That's good. You're going to go squadron max this way. So we will be using our various... support units to corral in the enemy. Okay, we've got our battleships together. That's good. What have we got for you, buddy? Two 8-inch guns, 5-inch... Okay. It's not bad for you. You've got 9-inch guns on you, so... Our heavy, our heavy, uh, our heavy cruisers are better than theirs. Okay. Have you just? Start following. Okay. These guys cut across there, protect our flank. Their high, their heavy cruisers already pulled out of the fight. Essentially, it's gonna be non-useful from here on out. Okay. Let's slow you down a bit to 16 knots. Let everybody else catch up. Okay, we are engaging their battleships. They are standard dreadnoughts. I think they might have heavier armor than us. Yeah. These 12-inch guns, though, on the Fuji, on the on the hat class, are gonna be pretty good, though. This one's gonna be decent. This one, not so much with the 10-inch guns and less belt armor. It'll be good. Okay. Basically, we just want to get a gun line going. I want to try and corral these battleships up. Come on. Okay, some destroyers are getting hit. Devastation took a hit from a couple of seven inchers. Okay. Let's go 15. Let's get you down to 14. We're going to slow these guys down a bit. Doing fine. Okay, a couple of hits there. All right. Gonna try and break these off into use like kind of easier chunks for their ships. They've already broken off this force of threes, so that actually makes us have a higher chance of knocking them out. Let's just make sure we're targeting those guys. 6,000 yards, yes. 
These guys. Yes. And these guys. I want them. And them, yes. I'm going to try and make sure these guys kind of pull off. I want them away from this f unit of four battleships so that we can kind of use that to our advantage. Okay. Sheffin. Okay. Shira. Taking some hits, but you're doing okay. The Staff, the Shuffin class is getting hit. Taking some light damage. It's firing at the heavy cruisers, which is good. We want it to. We want it because they have recognized that we're trying to cut them off. That's that's good for us. Okay. All right, they're making a turn in, so get a good turn this way and this way and this way. This will mean they, they're not getting decent shots on us. Just keep going that way. We're just continually trying to get everybody together. Make sure you're screening. You're on fire. You're taking some hits. So I'm going to have you just turn that direction. Okay, Devastation's taking some hits. Light damage on you. Let's just keep this going. Yeah, she's taking a beating, but she's got the armor for it. Shuffling class is taking more hits. They're very much trying to knock out these cruisers. Which makes sense, because they are at a disadvantage in cruisers here. Uh, I want to just make sure she's doing okay. It's a long-range hit, so she should be alright. Yeah, it's just a medium hit. Just heading a little bit. Just heading a little bit for you. Light damage. Heavy damage on you. Let's hope that's true. You're still trying to get back. You've been separated. If it comes down to it, we'll, uh, we'll break off. We can head north at full speed. Or we'll break off, we'll do like a roundabout and go down to a circle and we'll take, uh, we'll go to, uh, uh Tekio. Okay, taking some damage. Yeah, they seem to be focusing on those light cruisers and cruisers. Now we can do start doing some weird stuff to get them to uh, focus a bit more on them. Okay. Straight on. Taking a lot of hits here on the Fuji on our lead ships. Shmir is on fire. Okay. She is going to go split off. We're going to start doing turns around. Alright. Okay, we're breaking off our fight now. bad hits there.
breaking off down that way. Don't know why they were so spread out, the battleships, but it should still be okay. We're going to try and pull out of here. Okay. Gonna try and get out. There's a good chance we'll lose some cruisers here. the port she said nine knots go this way again make it look like we're wanting to do some fighting Get them to turn off a bit. Come on. Steffen class is that uh, yeah, the Steffen class is taking a lot of hits. Down to 10 knots as well. We destroyed that ship up there. Protecting our heavily damaged ships. Okay, peel off here. Come on. When does night fall? We've got a little bit to go. What we can do is have you just start going north. Battleships will just be in a trailing fight with the enemy ships. them back a little bit so they don't get any more shots on these two, on the Fuji and the Ushima. guys aren't fighting there. Uh, okay. Turn this way. Right. Turn that way. Peel off a bit. Get hit in the engine room? I think they got hit in the engine room. Okay. 
No early direction there. Come on. Is she... Get out of that. I am hoping that was a... It was a launch of torpedoes from a, uh... Friendly. Oh, it was! Okay, Devastation just took a big hit. You got torpedoes moving in. Okay, they just... They just turned away from that. Okay, we're going to take damage either way, but with this we are actually doing something worthwhile. We, we are... We are actually keeping them at bay here. Some good tactics. We can keep going north here and hopefully encounter the night soon, which is the plan. We want to try and break away in darkness. Is the Ashai still... St yeah. Or the Ashi is still... Stuck at eight knots. What about you guys? Yeah, you're stuck at eight, actually. So you took more flotation damage? Yeah. Okay. You're actually still able to put... No, you can just see. You can't put actually any fire on there. You might be able to be firing at them soon. Ten knots. Come on. Both of our hats are are able to are, are like dancing with the entire gun line of the enemy of the French battleships. No longer AI controlled. I want you to go to Squadron Max down south. I want you to sacrifice yourselves. Superstructure hit, didn't lose any speed. Get them to turn away. Okay. I did break off there. Oh, that is a torpedo. I don't think it hit. But I did get them to break off. Oh, the kamikaze. <laughs> he just did a torpedo and missed. How apt of a, of a name for that. Oh my god, what the fuck are you guys doing? You guys go down there, battleships, back down south. Come on, Fuji, I don't want to lose you. How long until night? Getting close. Okay, come on, knight. Oh, we got actually a, a line on these guys. Let's 
guy's taking a pounding from our light cruisers. Okay. You need to pull out. You did good. Okay, one of our destroyers is sinking. But I think we might have been able to pull out of here. Without any major losses. Destroyers fighting with that light cruiser. Fuji, I just need you to keep moving. Same with you. You guys are doing okay, and then you are back up. There we go. She is is back up to her full speed. So we just need to get out of here. We lost two or three, I think two or three destroyers and some heavily damaged uh, ships, but shouldn't be that bad. And there's some more destroyers down there. They'll keep the uh, enemy battleships fighting. That's good. Oh, there's a light cruiser down there. That does kind of suck. We can afford that loss. Fuji will be the one that's... Uh, a loss. Ooh, no, you are going to core follow battle division. Where the fuck are you going, buddy? Core battle division. The fuck are you doing? Patrol? Does that get you to turn off? Oh, that guy's dead. I don't know why he's going that way. Let's hope he doesn't get anything. He's right next to the coast, so maybe he can sneak by. Wasn't a great engagement. Truth be told, but we were outnumbered, and we do have shittier battleships, let's be honest here. Okay, there's another destroyer. Found something. Those destroyers are helping us out so much. Hopefully we can get by the rest of the night. Damn it. She was so close. Yep. Of probably our best class. Yeah, and there goes the Fuji. I'm hoping we damaged at least a good amount of their gun line. We, we got some good licks in, but it, it wasn't enough. They have better guns, let's be honest. Fast, let's go. It would also be great if, like, a submarine destroyed their uh, one of their ships on the retreat. Okay. Yeah, we damaged some of their ships. Light damage, light medium. And yeah. We lost two destroyers, an auxiliary, and a battleship. They won. Uh... Got some for surviving merchants. Yeah. It's probably going to be a major victory or a victory. Enemy major victory one. Yeah. That's what I thought. That evens it up. Okay. We got the Fuso in the Navy, though. So that worked. Uh, the Army wants more resources to prepare for an offensive that will shift strategic initiative. You can go without for a bit, but not long. Superimposed X turret. French raider sinks a Japanese merchant outside of South Southern Africa. Lost another sub. Okay. So we st we're still winning by 10 points. <laughs> it's not great. Uh, 
we are probably we're gonna have the Fuso move to Southeast Asia because we're gonna need extra forces down there. Yeah, extra forces. Okay, but looking at the time, we're well over for this episode, but I don't like ending it in the middle of a fight. So thank you for joining me for this episode. If you liked it, please leave a comment down below. Set that like button. If you want to support the channel, hit the subscribe button down below, as well as take a look at the description down below, where I have links to my Discord and my Patreon page. I'll see all of you in the next episode. Bye!